Okay, well, welcome back to my new addition to the blog, Dallas Bonsai Garden. I thought it would be a neat thing to have you come here and just look in up close and personal at what I've got going on here with my little Japanese black pine seedlings from what you've been seeing to the pictures here. I want you to see just exactly what I've got going here when it comes to the wiring part of giving them their shape. I really didn't think it would be this easy to shape these without breaking them, but they came out pretty good using the copper annealed wire. The copper annealed wire is really stiff and it's going to hold its shape for a while. This nice big tub I have them in will allow them to grow their root system pretty good for a while before I transplant them into separate pots again. Now here's a few that I have in colanders. The few that are in colanders are black pines of the Mikawa variety. I'm not sure how well you can see the bends, but they are pretty radical. Again, I'm really surprised that the, during the bending process nothing broke on them. You can notice the wire really isn't that tight on these right now. Kind of loose in the fact. But as the trees get older, at the trunk sticking up, I'll reapply new wire and apply it tighter. And in the process, the wire will tighten up inside the trunk and allow the trunk to thicken up even more. I've done this on one of my other ones. Works out pretty well. I would also like you to notice, if you can possibly see it on this, the nice little buds that are forming on this one-year-old little seedling. Nice little buds coming up. Now this little guy was just a little bit bigger than the ones I just shown you. This one I got when it was two years old. It's now a seven year old tree. Still has a long way to go. But you can notice it's got some real nice growth coming up. Nice candles. You can see where I made the major chop and a new front, a new apex. Let's 